Hello everyone, myself Poonam. Today I am going to present my topic, Evaluation of Ring Enhancing Lesions in a Patient Complaining of Seizure on MRF. Introduction, Enhancing Brain Lesions with Clinical Focal Seizures and Inconclusive Diagnostic Feature on Anatomical Neuroimaging is an area that continues to challenge attending neurologists. The common differential in general population include tuberculomas, neurocysticercosis, brain abscesses, and metastatic lesions. In AIDS patients, the major differential diagnosis is between lymphoma and CNS uh, toxoplasmosis. The purpose of the study is to examine intracranial ring enhancing mass lesion in patient complaining of seizure using MRI plane plus contrast study. Aim and objective to evaluate ring enhancing lesion in patient complaining of seizure. Study type cross sectional observational study. Material and methodology. In uh, 110 patients complaining of seizure doing MRI in Government Medical College, Aurangabad, in age of 10 to 60 years, this was a hospital-based prospective study evaluating all cases of seizure, any episode, any type, and with any time duration, uh, from a period of January 23 to January 24. Children above age of 10 years, those having definitive CNS infection with head injury, cerebral palsy, and those not showing in ring enhancing brain lesions were excluded from the study. Role of MRI in confirmation of differential diagnosis where studies results were correlated with clinical follow-up. Protocol. Uh, first, uh, routine uh, sequences like axial and core T1, axial and core flare images, uh, axial T2 and SWI image, imaging, DWI imaging, double inversion recovery in sequences and um, T1 weighted sequences with contrast study. Further, you can add a spectroscopy for more confirmation. Our first case is tuberculoma. A 50 year patient complaining of seizures showing conglomerated ring enhancing lesion in right, right anterior temporal region, uh, which is showing uh, hyper intense on T2, uh, no, no restriction on flare, or mild diffusion restriction on TWI which can be seen in tuberculomas, no blooming on SWI, hypointense on T1, mostly likely suggestive pretermitous lesion, likely tuberculoma. The next patient is 45-year-old with seizure, showing incomplete ring-enhancing pattern in the right parietal region, showing a eccentric located scalus in flare images, no restriction on DWI, mild blooming on SWI, uh, and hypointense of T1 weighted images. This, the, it is showing multiple different stages. Also, uh, the, this is mostly a granulomatous region, likely neurocysticercosis. The Escobar staging for neurocysticercosis are four. That is, vesicular with viable parasite and intact membrane, collateral vesicular uh, after uh, four to five years uh, untreated or with early treatment, the cyst fluid becomes turbid as the membrane become leaky edema surrounds the cyst this is the most symptomatic stage granular nodular stage edema decreases as the cyst retracts further enhancement persists and then the final stage is nodular calcified stage uh, which is the end stage quiescent calcified cyst are seen in this stage the next patient is a 20 year old complaining of seizure showing a complete ring enhancing lesion in right frontal region um, showing surrounding edematous changes and restriction restriction likely suggestive of abscess. The next case is immunocompromised patient complaining of seizures shows multiple ring enhancing lesions in, in bilateral cerebellar hemisphere with surrounding perilegional edematous changes on clear images and mild restriction on DWI um, shows blooming on SWI likely to toxoplasmosis. The next case is glioblastoma multiformis. This is a patient uh, complaining of seizure, 70 year old, uh, showing uh, ring and incomplete irregular ring enhancing region in bilateral um, parietal region with surrounding perilegional edema showing restriction mild restriction on DWF. This is a mostly a case of neoplastic lesion, high grade glioblastoma. Mnemonic for ring enhancing lesion is doc magical doctor M metastasis A abscess G glioblastoma multiformis I infarct in subacute phase C contagion A 
vascular malformation, L lymphoma, DT malating disease, or radiation. In summary, how to evaluate ring enhancing lesion is uh, T2 weighted signal hyper or hyper intense, player restriction present or not, rim smooth or irregular, DWI restricted or facilitated, SWI, SWI peripheral blooming or not, FESTA eccentric scolus, uh, contrast complete or incomplete enhancement, perfusion and MR spectroscopy. Conclusion. Con Common cause of symptomatic epilepsy in 10 to 60 years age group with ring enhancing lesion on neuroimaging are tuberculoma followed by neurocysticercosis and brain abscesses which can be diagnosed by careful history through thorough clinical examination and appropriate investigation to plan for timely management for favorable result. Um, male is more predominant in the age group of 20 to 40. The most common type is TB. Uh, mostly location in parietal region. Discussion. Although secondary focal seizures with ring enhancing lesion is a novel phenomena in developing countries like India, the volume of literature is spare. In spite of attending magnitude of public health finance, uh, scientific studies are a few in number. In South India, infection of the CNS and single city, in, uh, city enhancing lesion accounts for 95% of the etiology for seizure in children. Two out of 42 cases in our study, 16 cases were found female and 26 were male, with male pre male is to female ratio 1.6 is to 1. Most people belong to the age group of 20 to 40. English and eldest at the pre uh, presentation were 5.3 years, 13.8 years respectively, with a mean age of 32 years. Small children mostly remain indoor, were safe from the risk factor and infection. Similarly, males being more exposed to outside environment and contact with diseased people were prone for different diseases. Those are also neglected in Indian ceremonial and seek for less attention. Thank you.